Hello and welcome to this week's video. Today we're in the charming old English village of Bybury in the Cotswolds. Join Elvis and myself as we take a walk around the village, finding out just what makes this pretty little village so popular, whilst capturing some black and white film photographs along the way. We start our walk at the top end of the village and head back on ourselves into the centre towards the River Colne and the famous Arlington Row. The history of Bybury dates back to at least the Iron Age and there are remains of a hill fort above the village. I have read that Bybury is actually two small villages separated by the river. On the one side of the river is Bybury and on the other Arlington. The Catherine Wheel, here on the right, dates back to the 15th century. A former blacksmith in Coopery making barrels for the beer trade. It became an inn back in the mid 1800s. By 1939, tourism in Bybury had already started to significantly increase. Here in early March, the village isn't overly busy, but during the summer months, it's a totally different story. The village is particularly popular with Japanese visitors. This is largely attributed to Emperor Hirohito having stayed in the village on his European tour in 1921. As we head down the path towards Arlington Row, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new here for more walks and photography around Old English villages. Your support for the channel is very much welcomed and appreciated. The cottages of Arlington Row are often referred to as the most photographed cottages in the Cotswolds. Originally built in 1380 as a monastic wool store, the building was then converted into a row of weavers' cottages in the 17th century. They are owned by the National Trust and are Grade 1 listed. They are still private homes except for number 9 which is now in use as a holiday cottage. The small boggy water meadow across the way is known as Rack Isle as they used to hang the wall there before being sent to Arlington Mill.
The Cotswolds has some splendid churches and Bybury is no exception. The first church was established in 899 and the Grade 1 listed Anglo-Saxon church, which stands before us today, was built in the middle to late 11th century, with further work in later centuries. The large house you see as we corner the path is the largest building in Bybury and is called Bybury Court, built in 1633 in the Jacobean style. It is a Grade 1 listed building and was recently a hotel. The hotel is now closed and is back as a private residence. As we near the end of today's walk, I hope you have enjoyed watching the video. If so, please give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching, I hope you have a great week ahead and see you in the next one.